So what are the main findings from this paper? So this paper looks at asthma and air pollution. So asthma is a really serious uh, condition worldwide. About 360 million people um, uh, have asthma and air pollution is one of those uh, causes of asthma. And we've known that for a long time, but what this paper does is estimate globally the number of um, uh, people that visit emergency rooms because they have such bad asthma attacks. Um, and, and this is the first time it's been done globally. So in what countries will we expect uh, the worst impact? So the worst impact is uh, in Asia. It also has the worst um, air pollution, so that's why um, more air pollution caused emergency room visits are, are, are found in, in Asia, especially in China and India. And how would you like policymakers to act after taking part of these results? So um, if we're going to reduce the um, incidence of uh, asthma attacks from air pollution, then we need to take action on the sources of air pollution. Um, for example, there is a report coming out in a couple of weeks that says that if we implement 25 measures widely across Asia, then this can have a big reduction in air pollution. That's very interesting. Um, and what needs to be done to avoid future problems, I think, on a global scale? Well, essentially, um, we have to get rid of the air pollution, especially in the most polluted parts. But of course, um, the pollution is everywhere and affects us all but it affects uh, people more in those very polluted parts, such as in Asia. Um, and air pollution is increasing in parts of Africa and, and Latin America as well. So we, we have to deal with the sources of air pollution and reduce it. And are children also affected by this, of course? Um, yes, there's a lot of childhood asthma. Um, a lot of emergency room visits are related to childhood asthma. There's also a lot of evidence, and it's quantified in this paper, um, that new onset of asthma in children um, could be significantly affected by air pollution as well. It's not as certain, but they estimate that there could be 16 million new cases every year because of the air pollution. That's very severe. Thank you, Yuan, for this.